So these are the main views of the wear and the phone. And uh, first, let's try search by location. And it gives a list of profiles of people. Of course, we just uh, fill in the dummy data. And blue uh, represents Republican, white is independent, and the red is Democrat. So our location is Berkeley CA. So we can see at last so we give Berkeley CA here, right? And uh, if we click like Saruman, it will give some of the phone the detailed information of Saruman. And uh, also, of course, if we click directly on the image, uh, it will give your detail. And uh, click on this image, it will give the uh, uh, more info button. It will also give you the detail. So uh, next, uh, let's try search by zip code. So if we search by like a random zip code, and we search, and you see this profile updates again. And uh, what will happen to this final view? You can see this location disappears. Why? It's because we are now searching by zip code, and uh, we still don't have the API to uh, to represent to map this zip code to a specific location. So I just leave this part blank. And uh, if we have the API, I will update this here. So also you click here, you will get this. These are the same. And uh, finally, let's try shake. If I just uh, shake it, you can see uh, it will search randomly and generate a random number. And I say shake it again, it will generate a different number. So why the profile lists are the same? This is because I just uh, fill the dummy data. Uh, I just fill in this view with the same set of dummy data. After we got the API, of course, this will be different because uh, as the location changes, uh, this data access from the API will also be changed. So this is all for this part of the programming assignment.